48. Well, that should be a frame winner. Deserves to be a frame winner. Hope you enjoyed the bird's eye view of that one. Certainly gave you an indication of how little of the pocket that Stevens had to aim at. Very narrow angle of entry. But he's queuing very sweetly. We could yet have a cracking match on our hands. 56. Impressive response this though for Stevens to the disappointment of the first three frames, all of which he could have won. But he's shown his class here. Reminding John Higgins that he's around. And that's he's a big bounce. He still needs one more red, though. And as you say, Phil, that was a big bounce. 63. Well, he's got to dig deep again. 66 in the game. 67 left on the table. And he knows better than anyone that Higgins is more than capable of clearing these balls and stealing another frame. And that really would be a body blow. But that cue ball Joe really seemed to take off from the right side cushion it certainly did and nothing nothing at all that you can do about that you expect you play the shot where you expect the cue ball to land and it's so unfortunate when it comes off faster than it should do so just the safety Not safe yet. Tried to push the black onto the cushion, but that red Matthew needs to go past 63. the middle. Now, has it gone past enough? Would be a natural angle to come back down for the black. So the difference is 66. 67 left, so not much room for manoeuvre for Higgins here. All on this shot. There it goes. And it was a natural angle to come back down for the black. He needs a big bounce. Well, he's given himself a chance. Tough black. And he's going to have to play a little cannon to the Reds. Oh, now does the red pass the red? Listen if it to the does, crowd. they're really enjoying this out there. If the red passes, if not, then it's all the way around the table. Tremendous atmosphere out in the Wuxi Sports Centre. They are glued to their seats. As Higgins spots a foreign object in one of in one of the reds, Brendan Moore steps in to give the ball a polish but my goodness how mentally would Matthew Stevens be able to recover from this were he to lose this frame still a lot to do but there the Hawkeye confirmation yeah. that the red passes I just wonder if he can drop this in and stay on the black or will he have to go in and out of bark Well, he's played for the pink, which means he can only tie the frame now. A sigh of relief, I expect, from Matthew Stevens. He knows he won't lose the frame at this visit. Fifteen. Mind you, you wouldn't bet against Higgins forcing a respot from here. Yes, but it does mean that Matthew Stevens will get another shot. Had he been able to take blacks, he may not have been coming back to the table at all. He's been so unfortunate so far this morning, Matthew Stevens. And that big bounce just summoned it up. But it's not over yet. is on the yellow spot just behind the yellow there's a potential source of 
The rotation for Higgins as he looks to complete the clearance here and force the respotted black. Now needs to leave an angle on the black to be able to get to the yellow. And the yellow is easily easily gettable if he comes up that right side of the table. Fifty-two. Just needs to come to it from the middle pocket. So a stun just before the middle pocket gets him onto the yellow. He's a little hard. He's a little hard. <laughs> but he's nicely on the yellow. Higgins has made clutch clearances just like this one countless 14. times in his career. Nerves of steel at his best. Rock solid temperament. What must Matthew Stevens be thinking 44. right now? What must he be feeling? He'll be thinking I need to play a good safety shot on the black. If indeed it's him to strike first. Perfectly on the on the blue. Fifty-three. One good positional shot then. We seem headed for a respot. Just overdone it a little, but he's nicely on the black. Stand by for the applause. Brilliant. Well, vintage Higgins there. Stevens desperately unlucky to get a bad bounce when he was on the very cusp of clinching his first frame, but how ruthless Higgins was. Stepped in with a clearance to tie the scores. And so this fourth frame comes down to a shootout on the black. A respot. Stevens at least from his point of view has won the toss something's gone his way and he's invited Higgins to have first crack Find at this black please. what a huge black ball this is in the context of this match surely if Higgins were to pot it and move 4-0 in front it's just too tall an order for Stevens but if he can pinch the frame the match is back on big moments coming up here still buzzing with excitement at what they've seen so far high drama whooshy well would you believe it I swear Stevens had almost released the cue there and yet more noise from the crowd you can understand their excitement at what they're seeing but they really have to be mindful that these players need the utmost concentration at moments like this. Yes, he's considering taking the double on into the corner, sending the cue ball up into Bork. Full of danger, that shot. Took it on. He hasn't been afraid of going for it today. So far, it's not paid off, and will that prove to be very costly as well? Well, he just played it a little too hard for my liking. The cue ball should have been closer to the cushion, and that way the black wouldn't have travelled the third time across the table. This for 4-0 at the interval for John Higgins. Oh, so close. But he's got a good cue ball. It was a millimetre away, no more. So close, in fact, that he might have fluked it into the opposite pocket. This is potable, but it's very, very tough. You're not kidding. And also, the enough is on into the park corner. And that would just about set the seal on 
Matthew Stevens afternoon. And if he can somehow sink this one and keep the cue ball on the table in the process, he'll feel a lot better as he goes off for his interval refreshments. Oh. Well, at least the cue ball hasn't gone in the pocket. He's got a very good cue ball. And this is a very tough pot indeed. Close to the cushion and very straight. Makes it very tough. This will take some potting. Well, at least it's just off straight. Oh, Great he's pot. nailed it. What a hammer blow for Matthew Stevens. He looked a certainty to win that frame, but he got a bad bounce. He lost position. Higgins produced a typically clinical clearance, and instead of 3-1, it's 4-0.